Good morning. Viewers, I am Sikaram Cost Accountant. This video presentation is about a fourth is Healthy Care Limited. Today, market crashed by more than 1000 points, but uh, this stocks shoot up by nearly 7.96%. Now, we may analyze about this stock, whether it is uh, having potential to go upward. Okay. Today, opening price was nearly 201 and the peak level was it uh, nearly the peak price 224 and the closing price is nearly 290 okay and one month before the share prices was nearly 180 range and the six months before the share prices was in the range of please see here 135 range from 135 within six months it has given nearly 50 percent return to investors and the year to date return is uh, nearly 155 162 nearly 220 nearly 50% return with year to date return within 3 months one year before the share prices was the low prices of nearly 150 range from the 150 range now it is traded the curve is vertically on 45 degree move please see here and a 5 year chart you may see the peak level price was nearly 220 nearly uh, april 17 nearly four years back the share prices was in the range of two ton now it has reached that level after uh, after went to two minimum level of nearly 100 150 on that that range now it is vertically moving upward vertically moving upward and also you may see the maximum chart in the 10 years to 12 years back the share prices was people see here nearly 60 to 70 range now it is in the nearly three times within 12 years this all are the technical chart about the company and also you may please see here the day range 201 to 227 and the year range 113 to 227 year range and today is the high prices 52 week high prices today recorded please see here and the the, the about the company the fourth is healthcare limited is a china private hospital headquarters in india Fourth is uh, started is the uh, health care operations from Hawaii, where the first fourth is hospital was started. Later on, on the hospital chain purchased the health care branch of Escort Group and increased its strength in various parts of the country. The Escort Heart and Research Center and the Delhi Center became a major operating unit of the chain, which was headed by an array uh, Tegrin. Okay, this and also you may see the company operates is the healthcare delivery services in India, Dubai and Sri Lanka with 36 healthcare facilities. Please see here, these all are the details and also the Malaysia IHH healthcare became the controlling shareholder of fourth is healthcare limited by acquiring 31.1 percent of the company. So it is a Malaysian old company, Malaysian owned company and a the employee strength is 16,306, founded in the year 1996. Please see here, these all are the company's details. And also, we may go to, this is the quarterly results curve, and this is the annual curve. Now, we may see the company's details, presentation delivered by the company. This is the presentation, Q3 FI 21, delivered by the company that we may see one by one. Please see here, this is the key data. The occupancy in Q2, FA21 was 57%. Now, the latest quarter, Q3, FA21, it is a 64%. Okay, this is a very good positive factor. The performance highlights, you may see that this is a performance highlight. And the revenue growth versus Q3, FA21 was at 35%. Okay. The revenue growth was 35 percent. Consolidated earning summary. This is a very very important part in this video. The consolidated operating revenue in the Q3 FI 21. Q3 FI 21 it is 1168 and uh,
you may compare this figure, the Q3 FI21, it is a 1177 as against a Q2 FI21, 994. 994, when compared with a Q1, it was a 605. Please see here, from the 605 crores, it uh, has grown to 994. Once again, it has grown to 1174. When compared with the two, two quarters back, the income nearly doubled. The income nearly doubled. And the profit uh, before tax depreciation amortization also increased from 98 crores to negative to 145 crores plus and then 200 crores plus. Please see here. This is the positive factor. Profit before tax also increased. Profit before tax also from 37 crores to 103. Previous quarter comparison. This is a previous quarter comparison. Please see here. When compared with the year of year quarter, it was 48 crores. From 48 crores to it is the, now it has increased. It has increased to 103 crores. Okay. This is the earning potential summary. Please see here. Revenue Q2 994 already we have seen EBITD 145 to 200. Similarly, profit after tax Q2 15 crores to 53 crores. The, the company has declared a good Q3 results. Good Q3 results. This is the hospital business growth. We may see the nine months results. We may see. Operating performance, a diagnostic business. This is a balance sheet. Balance sheet position, the latest position, shareholders equity. Shareholders equity, latest uh, 6, 6,883 crores. It uh, rupees in crores, uh, shareholders equity, dead burden, 1,359 crores. The company's debt burden is 1,359. This is a revenue mix. The non-surgical revenue 44%, surgical revenue 56% in the Q3 of A20. Now, the non-surgical revenue 52%, surgical revenue 48% in the latest Q3 of A21. This is hospital business performance, net revenue performance, this is a diagnostics business Q3 FI21, in Q3 FI20 it was a 249, now it has been increased to 306, 306 and also please note the operating margin increased from 16 to 24 percent, 23.9 percent. This is uh, the Q3 FI21 geographical mix, geographical mix. North 38%, South 10%, West 32%, East 18%. Group consolidated and a profit loss account, Q3 FA21. You may please see here the revenue from operation, Q3 FA20. This is a consolidated 1168.90. Whereas uh, now 1177.0 slightly maintained the same level. Profit before tax, but uh, doubled from 44 crores to the year of year quarter. Now it has been increased to 85 crores. Please see here 85 crores. The net profit before tax uh, 48 crores year of year quarter. Now it is a uh, 103 crores. The uh, net profit has uh, dramatically improved from 48 crores to 103 crores. That is the uh, biggest uh, trigger point for this company. And uh, this is the group's consolidated nine months results. 
okay now we may come to a conclusion that uh, fourth is a uh, health care is a uh, declared a yeah, very good uh, q3 results now the share prices is uh, nearly 80 to 90 percent approved from the 52 weeks low prices it is now traded at the 52 weeks high prices so the investors are requested to include in, in your portfolio when it comes down below 180 180 to 180 range please buy short to buy and uh, continuously buy on every market corrections and hold for one to three one to two years you may expect a return of 50 percent suppose if you buy and hold for five to six years your return will be doubled okay that is a way which is a more than double when compared with the bank's interest rate of deposit uh, interest rate okay so investors are requested to trade cautiously in this center because uh, 52 it is a uh, traded nearby 52 with high prices if, if, if anything the bear position bear grips stocks automatically the prices will be go down because of the equity capital of the company is very high more than 700 crores 750 crores okay but uh, the institutional holding is a uh, very uh, high 50 percent is uh, held by institutions 31 percent is uh, held by promoter only 19 percent is uh, held by public or non-institutions okay risk is small but uh, be cautiously trade in the stock but uh, in long for long term it is a good stock but short term we cannot predict because already it is in the 52 weeks uh, higher trade prices okay happy investment and happy trading thank you for viewing this video